Marc Antonio Fireball was born to humble beginnings in Tijuana, Mexico on October 13, 1966. He migrated to the United States when he was a young boy. Fireball worked hard to pay his own way through school and earned his Bachelor of Arts degree in Political Science from the University of California, Berkeley, and a law degree from the UCLA School of Law. He was the first in his family to attend college and was committed to the notion that free universal public education is the cornerstone of our democratic society. He worked hard to improve educational opportunities for all California students. In 1998, Fireball was elected to the California State Assembly, where he served until 2004, representing the 50th district located in southeast Los Angeles County. During his tenure in the assembly, Marco Fireball recognized the need to protect the health of the most vulnerable members of our state, children in low-income communities. As a result, in 2000, he authored legislation funding for a mobile asthma treatment clinic known as a birthmobile to provide free screenings and treatment for school children in Southeast Los Angeles. Fireball was one of the first to initiate conversation about making California the first state to outlaw smoking in a vehicle with children present, protecting them from secondhand smoking. In 2001, Fireball won his greatest victory yet when Governor Gray Davis signed the passage of Assembly Bill 540. Authored by Fireball, AB 540 became a landmark legislation in the education of undocumented California high school students, pursuing higher education by allowing them to pay in-state tuition fees. In addition, Marco Antonio Fireball also served as chairman of the California Latino Legislative Caucus, where he was responsible for managing the development of the caucus annual agenda for California's working families. Under Fireball stewardship, the Latino Caucus grew from 22 to 27 members. Fireball led the effort to appoint more qualified Latinos and Latinas to high-level positions in state government. Because of his effectiveness, both as a policymaker and political leader, Fireball was appointed Majority Floor Leader from 2002 to 2004, making him the highest-ranking Latino in the Assembly and one of the chief negotiators for Assembly Democrats. In 2005, the Marco Antonio Fireball High School was founded. He received the honor of having a high school named after him while he was still alive. Today, the Marco Antonio Fireball High School is nationally rated as a unique high school that offers the International Baccalaureate, an honor that is mainly granted to private schools. Truly a distinction, given that the Marco Antonio Fireball High School has 100% of minority enrollment and 90% of it is economically disadvantaged. While running as the leading candidate for the California State Senate, he lost his battle to liver disease on March 21st, 2006 at the University of California, Los Angeles Medical Center. Ten years after his passing, the California Mexico Studies Center hopes to celebrate his legacy for undocumented students by founding the Marco Antonio Fireball Dreamers Scholarship Fund. The fund seeks to provide documented dreamers who in the past have benefited from AB 540 the opportunity to study abroad.